every time we meet you want to discuss numbers and so you put us in that precarious position and so it's not something that I oftentimes celebrate. Mm -hmm. um, as you know we just enjoy the month and a half lull of not having violent crime and yes that is a good thing but that does not mean that the police is in any way letting up its guard and staying on the beat and staying on the ground. Uh, it is just unfortunate that we are having these incidents, the one that played out with the triple murder, very unfortunate in San Pedro. Um, but again, good police work. We're hoping it can lead to the arrest of those two uh, individuals um, and likewise uh, lead to the arrest of the two responsible for the murder in Hatteville as well. It is in a rural community um, and of course uh, it, it appears to have been robbery, robbery as the motive. And so it's very difficult to be able to predict things like that. Uh, the police cannot be everywhere all at once and that is why we rely heavily on the community on neighborhood watch groups uh, to respond whenever you notice uh, suspicious individuals in your neighborhood to call the police so that the police can come and, and take preventative action uh, so that we do not have this kind of loss of life